Hello, my NC7C adventurers. Look at this magnetic book with lots of dinosaur puzzle pieces to build. Are you ready? Huh? What's this? This is not the right dinosaur. Let's fix that up. That looks so funny. All right. Hmm, let's start with Triceratops. This is Triceratops head. Let's place it right here. Let's look for his body. These seem to be hind legs of Triceratops. There they go. What about the forelegs? There. That seems right. Let's place it over here. Let's adjust the head. And now let's look for the tail. There it is. That's the tail of Triceratops. Triceratops is an herbivore. That means he is a plant eater. Hey, I have an idea. How about we offer him some vegetable? A broccoli. Let's cut the broccoli in half with this toy knife that I got right here and give him a piece of broccoli. Here you go, Mr. Triceratops. Have a piece of broccoli. Oh, you seemed really hungry. Bye bye, Mr. Triceratops. Let's make this one. It has got an interesting pattern. Hmm. That are the four legs. Lots of stripes on it. All right. So after placing the four legs, let's look for up. Oh, there they are. The hind legs. Let's put the hind legs over here. Now let's look for its head. Oh, there it is. That seems to be the right head because it has got the same stripes that are on its body. And there's the tail. This is an iguanodon. Iguanodon is also an herbivore. That means this dinosaur is also a plant eater. Let's offer him a fruit this time. How about a strawberry? Yeah, let's cut the strawberry in half and offer him this sweet strawberry, which has exactly the same colors as Mr. Iguanodon, red and green. Iguanodon is also green and red. Let's cut it into half. Here you go, Mr. Iguanodon. Enjoy the sweet strawberry. Bye bye, Mr. Iguanodon. Now let's see this one. Ooh, I know these hind legs and four arms. Those itty bitty arms and the tail. This is a T Rex. Ooh, T Rex is a carnivore. That means he is meat eater. I have something for you, Mr. T Rex. Here's some roasted chicken. Whoop, not my finger. Bye bye, Mr. T Rex. Let's make this one. It's back legs, tail, four arms, and the head. Oh, I know this one. This one is Mr. Velociraptor. Velociraptor is also a carnivore. That means he's a meat eater. Let's offer him a drumstick. Here you go, Mr. Velociraptor. Oops. Oh, you seem really hungry. All right, Mr. Velociraptor, bye-bye. Now let's make this one. Ooh, I know this head. It's the head of Parasaurolophus. And it's four arms, hind legs, and last but not the least, the tail. 
to tail. Hey, where's the tail? Oh man, where did the tail go? Right here? No. Um, I can't see it anywhere. Oh, I wish the dinosaurs could speak so that they could tell me where the tail went. <laughs> Did you wish that dinosaurs could speak? Ah! Did the dino just speak? Did the dino just really speak? Oh, I think I think I heard T-Rex say something. Oh. Was it really me or did Dinah speak? Nope, I spoke. Ah! Don't be scared, it's okay. You wish the dinosaurs could speak and your wish came true. Oh, uh, do you eat? No, I'm not here to eat. I'm just here to ask that if we could speak, would you like to know what we would tell your children? Yeah, sure, go ahead. What would you say? <laughs> If the dinos could speak, they would tell you how lovely you are. Uh, okay, thank you. If the dinos could speak, they would tell you how lovely you are. Huh? This is Insimency see Kindness episode. Exactly. Maybe the T-Rex would say... What? Brachiosaurus could speak too? Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. Maybe the T-Rex would say... Wow, you're so kind. Would you teach me that too, please? If you don't mind. Um, yeah, sure. <laughs> if, if the, the dinos, dinos could speak... speak they would tell you how lovely you are. If the dinos could speak, they would tell you how lovely you are. Huh? The Sophia's bedtime episode? Maybe when Brachiosaurus sees you, she would say, I'm really impressed. How you keep yourself so clean and how very well dressed. If the dinos could speak, they would tell you how lovely you are. If the dinos could speak, they would tell you how lovely you are. If Triceratops sees your puzzle, maybe she would want to play too. I would love to play with her and see how she'll do. See, that's what I'm saying. You guys care and share and make sure your dealing is always true and fair. If the dinos could speak, they would tell you how lovely you are. Oh, so sweet. Thank you very much. That's so very nice of you guys. Well, that's about it for this NCVNC episode. If you liked it, then give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next NCVNC adventure. Bye bye. Bye. Hey, wait a minute. You guys became puzzle pieces again. But, 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 w w where is the tail of Parasaurolophus? Anyone?